try this again. I have tried... This is the third time. Let's see if third time's a charm. I've been trying to play this game on here. The first time it froze. The second time, apparently, I didn't... I didn't set up my stream right, so it did not work. Normally when I play, I um, I do ASMR, so I whisper my gameplay. I'm, I'm not in the mood to do that right now. <laughs> I just want to play the damn game. So where did it go? There it is. All right. This is Fossil Corner. Um, I don't even know if my chat box is working, so forgive me if I don't see if you chat, if you ask me a question, unfortunately, I don't know if I'm going to be able to see you talking or chatting. So just enjoy this. I think this is a test. I am just going to see if I can play this game and see if my stream works, and that's it. And if it does, next time I will do ASMR gaming. Okay, I forgot what I was doing. Also, when I opened this earlier, I had lost all of my data. <laughs> it started the game over brand new, and then I realized I had turned, I got this through Steam, and I had turned off the, um, oh God, I don't know what you call it, the live connection, or the, um, Anyway, the thing that allowed it to save to the cloud, I had turned that off because I was having trouble with my computer, and apparently you can't turn that off or it won't save your data, so now I've found, I have got it back and I have all my data here, I have all my fossils. Um, I was going to say, let me know if you can't hear me, but I probably won't know if you, if you say anything because I I don't know if this chat is working. I guess I won't know until somebody tries to chat. So I am a scientist and, uh, excuse me, I'm gonna burp. Sorry. I am a scientist or an ex-paleontologist or a retired paleontologist and I was obsessed with fossils and trilobites. And I have been recently contacted um, by a couple of e-magazines or online magazines and uh, kind of got back in the game so did I do this one okay no I didn't so I need to get a picture to them of three um, special fossils with a I guess it's a classification number it's the three um, it has to have the three so let me show you if I go back to my um, shells, you can see this is a number one, this is a one, this is a one, this is a one, this is a two, a two, a two, and a one, and this is a two. I have, I think, two already of the number threes. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Um, let's go here and look at my stash. Okay, so there we go. I have two number threes, or I have two uh, level threes, and I need one more. So let's see if we can get one more on this next game. Let's get a box of shells. And we're gonna drag it to our desktop. Our desktop. <laughs> I'm thinking in computers. No, this is our actual desk. And then we have to unpack it. and we need to arrange the shells. Um, now it's not really the color of the shell. Uh, they're different colors that they're just telling you this is where they go. This is the level in their family tree. So um, I don't think the colors matter. Ooh. Whoa, this is a red one. Whoopsie. And we won't know exactly what these shells are until we finish their family tree. Okay, now you notice we have four shells here that do not have a color. 
So we don't know what classification they are. We don't know where they belong in this family tree. We're going to find out as we go along because there'll be a missing link. And one of these are a missing link. Okay, so the way you do this is you go by the traits and each level in the family tree can only have one change in the traits. It can either be bigger or smaller. It can either have a different shaped aperture, that's the hole where the animal crawled in, um, or it can be taller or shorter, something like that. But only one, there can only be one change. So here we go, this is our starting point. It is a um, smooth shell with a stripe. Um, oh, that's another thing. So some have dashes and stripes. It uh, The next one, uh, we have two choices here. I mean, some of these might also be choices, but we won't know yet. So this has the same size, I mean, same shaped aperture. This also has the same shaped aperture. This is, um, it's got a stripe. Uh, this also has a stripe, but it has two changes. It has dashes and it has spines. Uh, so it can't be that one. It has to be this one. Oops, sorry. No. Okay, so that is correct, I think. Actually, I don't think we'll know. If, if it's not correct, it'll go wham. So this one, these go together because they are the same shape, the same shaped aperture, and um, they have a stripe, but it is flat as opposed to tall. So that is correct. Then we have, this is the same shape, oh, but it has spines and dashes, so it can't be that one, can't be this one. It can be this one. It's got the same shaped uh, aperture, and the only difference is, one difference, it's got another stripe. So that should be the end of the family tree. Let's find out. That is our family tree. And I am going to, excuse me, I'm just gonna move stuff around. I'm gonna move this over to the side because we're not going to use that again. We might use these other ones, but we can't use that because this circle means it's the end of the family tree or the family line. So let me put this one back. Um, let's see if there's something else. This is also, this can also be um, from this line because it's the same shape. Sorry, um, not the same shape. It's the same size. It's got a stripe but the aperture is different so whoopsie if you don't click it the right way they go sliding all over the board okay so let's click that and then this one yep okay next mm -hmm -hmm. i don't think either of these yeah neither of these are going to be able to go with this one now there's a missing link because the color coding has to stay so this obvious, obviously does not match that one in any way, except for the shape. It's got a square aperture, but um, this has two, well, this has um, spines, and it also has dashes. So it does not go with this one at all because it's got too many uh, differences. It has, yeah, the differences are. The same, they're both the same size, they both have a stripe, but um, this has two other differences. It's got spines and dashes, so let's see. Here's one that it could possibly go with. This has spines. Sorry, I'm covering my mouth. This has spines, this has a stripe, and it has a square aperture, so there's only one difference, and that is that this has dashes. So let's see if we can connect them. Okay, um, and I think you have to connect something in each generation. So this does not go with this at all. So one of these has to go here. So we have 
this is everything the same. It's got a square aperture. It's got um, spines. It's the same height, but the only difference is it's missing a stripe. So we're going to put this one over here. And then this one, it got the stripe back again. So, hello. <laughs> that just flung into the atmosphere. Okay, oh, this one could match. It's the same, everything is the same, except it's shorter. So we're gonna try that one. There we go, there's a family tree. And this one can also match as well. Yes, great. So what are we gonna do with these two? Um, oh, let me move these over. These, that's the end of the family tree, so we're gonna get that off the board. And this one actually could be a descendant of this one because everything is the same except the aperture is on the left instead of on the right. Yeah, I could be a scientist. There we go. The only one left is this one. Hmm, it could go anywhere. This, okay, this one is spiny. Oh no. It's got two differences. Okay, I think it's going to go here because this is the same. Aperture is the same. Size is the same. It's got spines. It's got dashes, but it has another row of dashes instead of a stripe. So let's see if we're correct. Hello? Oh yeah. Oh, it could be correct, but also it might go with this one. No. <gasps> no. Okay, let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that connection. Hmm. This is not the end. Okay, okay. Let me move stuff out of the way so you can see it. I think Wait, did I already try that? I'm gonna put this here. Maybe that was two changes. Because not only did it get rid of the stripe, it added another row of dashes. So that's two changes. I think it goes with this one. What the heck, man? What the heck? Wow. If you don't click it in exactly the right spot, do we click it right in the middle? Nope. What the heck? Okay, you have to click it at the very tippy top. Hello? What happened? Oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh I messed up what I was doing. After I even had it complete. Okay, I think it was this one. Come on! Tippy top. Fudge. I try not to swear. Tippy top. There we go. Let's see if this goes, I think it goes with this one because it's everything's the same except there's an extra row of dashes. Ah, yes. Now this one, everything is the same except it's shorter. Oh man, that was tough. I thought this was supposed to be meditative, Holly. What the hell is this? This isn't meditative, this is stressful. Click a fossil to add it to your collection. Are any of these number threes? 
Why aren't any of these number threes? Oh, I like this one. It looks like a birthday cake. Oh, this one's even prettier. No, I like the purple one better. This one's pretty though. It's got orange and red. Yeah, I think I'll pick this one. Okay. I'm taking that one. Porsa Subsidi... Subsida... I don't know. Okay. I'm taking that one. Alright, let's go get another box of shells because we still need a, a number three. We need a number three shell for our photograph. Unpack the box of shells. Uh oh, are we freezing again? I hope not. Oh, I got, oh shoot, I got two emails. Come on, man. Purple, blue, blue. We don't know what that is. So this one with the question mark, we don't know anything about it. I mean, at least these other ones, you can see the, what the shell looks like. You just don't know where it goes on the family tree. Okay, these go in the red section. Okay, so these could go anywhere on this list, but let's see what this matches with. This, okay. This matches this one very closely. There are spines and um, stripes and the same shape aperture, but it also has dashes. So we're gonna put it with that one. Next we have, uh, nope, that can't be it. All right, here we go this one. It's exactly the same, except it's smaller. Ah, hey, we finished that family tree, so I'm just going to move it off to the side. So you can actually build on this one or this one, but um, this one we need to get out of the way. Okay, um, does this one go with this in any way? Uh, no, there are two changes because the aperture shape is different and it's got spines, so that's two different things. Um, so we need another one that goes here. This one could possibly go with it because it looks exactly the same, except it's missing a stripe. So I am going to click that one and that one, and then need another one that's the same that only has one difference. This one has some added stripes, but everything else is the same. Okay, and then this one is exactly the same, but it's smaller. <gasps> no! What's the difference? Okay, this is the same. This is... Smaller. Those should match. What the heck? Those are our match. Oh, well, maybe this is this is the one that doesn't belong. Oh, maybe it's this one. Oh, could it be? Ha. Okay, that's what it was. Tricky game. Tricky, tricky. Okay, now, still, we don't know where these go, but we have these last two. So let's start from the, the end and work our way to the front. This one matches this one very closely. Let's look at that. Are they different sizes? Nope, they're the same size. They have a, a stripe and dashes. The only difference is this has spines and this one doesn't. Oh, no. Okay, it's not that. What about this one? 
this is the same except it's got no dashes there. And what does this go with? This is the same except it's got dashes. Hey, all right. Now this one, it's got dashes, it's got stripes and a round opening. Um, and it does go with that one. It looks exactly the same, except it's, wait, nope, nope, it's got two changes. It's bigger and flatter. So, let's see. Could this be the one? Same size. Nope, too many differences. Dang. Dang. Okay, I'm lost. Maybe one of these other ones? Oh, actually, yeah, it could be either one of these because they don't have the circle underneath. This one I can't use because that's the end of the family tree. So, we could match this to one of these two because I don't think it goes with either of these. Yeah, it doesn't go with either one of these. Nope. Okay. Alright, this one has spines and stripes and a round aperture, but it's taller. So I'm going to click it with this one. <gasps> what? So neither of these even needed to be there? Wow. Okay, we can see if this goes with either one of these. Okay, these both have square apertures. They're about the same size. Yep, but it's got dashes instead of lines. So I'm going to, whoops. Oh, okay. Let me move this. Move this over out of the way. Okay, I'm going to put this here and I'm going to click on it and click on this one. That, that's got to be a descendant, though. Okay. What else? Okay, this one's smaller. No. This one? No. Damn. I don't think that's right, then. It could... Oh. It could also go here. Because, look. This is square. It's got dashes and spines, same size, but it also has stripes. Let's see. Yes. Okay, now, what does this one go with? These are about the same size and height, same aperture, same dashes, but the difference is it is missing stripes. So let's see if it goes with that. Click, click. I don't know. We can continue on. Uh, dashes. Whoa, look at that. That looks like chocolate. I guess I'm hungry. Okay, I don't know. Wait a minute, I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to put this here. This looks like a match as well. Okay, and then it could... No? What the heck? Okay, I need a hint. Really? Okay. So, yeah, you can ask for a hint if you give up. Alright. Now, I want that one. Unless... Nope, I need a number three. I need a three, but that one's so cool. Oh man, I really need this one, but that one's so cool. I'll play again. I'll play again. It's okay, that one's just too cool. It's too stinking cool. Alright, I'm going to stash this one and put this one up here next to the other pretty one. Look, they're all sparkly. Opalized. 
pyritized. Oh, interesting. Okay. I guess I gotta check my emails. Uh, floor of the volunteer. Oh, great. Well, hope you like it. I thought it was pretty cool. If you don't mind me asking, what was going on at your retirement party? You seem pretty off. I don't know. Okay. Seeking photographer. Okay. They still need the three three star fossils. Cleaning? That's spelled wrong. Clean again your garage. I Nate 9 am emailing you this. I am wanting to remind you that you said would pay me and my friend Steve M to clean out the junk out of your garage. And if I did that, you would give us some money. So if you are wanting your it cleaned, please do it because we need money for some things. Sincerely, Nate. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, that was for this. They're cleaning up this junk, this pile of crap. Oh, geez, all this junk is embarrassing. You really thought that painting was profound when you made it. Say la vie. Yeah, okay. So, Nate. Oops. Yeah. Sorry. Nate. Oh, shop. Wait, what happened? Back to the mail. Cleaning your garage. Reply. I replied. Oh, hopefully I did that right. Thanks. Okay. Let's get some more fossils because we still need another number three shell. Unpack. Show me a number three. Think. I don't know, it's got two colors on it. It could be blue or brown. Oh, maybe that's what it means. Oh no. Oh, and I'm putting them all in the brown because uh, I just confused myself. Okay, oh my god, all of these. Look at all these brown ones. Too many. So maybe these do go in the blue or purple. Actually, that's purple, not teal. And is this? This is teal. No, that's green. What the heck? Yeah, somebody else was saying, that's really confusing because the colors are very close. So we have... Oh, there's way too many of those. I wonder if these could go somewhere else. Because they have purple on the bottom. I don't know. I guess we'll find out well, as soon as we play. I'm gonna say this goes in the green because there's only one there. Might be wrong, but who knows? Okay. This goes with this. It's exactly the same except it's square instead of round. And then this one, nope, too many changes. It has to go with this because it doesn't go with this one. I have no clue. <laughs> what? I have no clue what's on it. So I'm just gonna have to guess. Okay, something that looks like this one. Dashes, square aperture. Okay, but it's, uh, I don't know. Something that looks exactly the same. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was amazing. That was a good guess. Okay. Now, now, this can also, or this one, no, I think we're done with that one because these are your only options. This to this one, because it can't go there because it's shorter and has a square aperture. That's two changes. So I'm going to match it to this one, just because that one was just used. And then this one to this one. Oh, yeah. 
This can also go with this one because the only thing that's changed is the aperture. This one can also go with this one because the only thing that's changed is it is shorter. This one can go with this one because again it's just shorter. one does it more closely match this one or this one it could possibly go with either one ah. all right look at this I'm a scientist now I'm a scientist because I've learned about fossils <laughs> is there a number three are you kidding me there's no number three on here why well this one's pretty I like this one there's no number two. This is a number two. I wonder if they're worth more. Brown and blue. Okay, lefty and colorful. Green and blue. You know what? I don't think I have any green ones. I'm gonna take that one. Whoopsie. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I like that one. Oh, I do have a green one. But let's. I'm going to swap it out. Put this one up here. Oh, it doesn't show up very well. I'm going to swap it. Put the purple one in the green and the green one on against the blue wall. And I'm going to put this in the stash. Oh my god, I have three emails now. I better check my emails. Cleaning your garage. Dear Flora, my friend named Steven, not Stevem, I always confused. <laughs> okay. Flora the volunteer. Wait, do I need to reply? No, I don't. Done. Uh, wow, sorry Flora, I'm just a little surprised. That is like a record-breakingly long email. Or should I say novel? Just kidding. Good on you for being in touch with your feelings. I had you pegged as and all fossils all the time type of person. Go figure. Regarding your problem, I definitely can't answer those kinds of questions. The best I can say is that for me, it helps to remind myself that I'm pushing the boundaries of science forwards, even by a little bit, you know? Like maybe 100 years from now, understanding how ancient ecosystems fit together will help another scientist fight climate change. At least that's what I tell myself. Damn, this is a novel too. Laura, can I suggest something? You should tell Lee about this. I think he'd really like to hear from you. I have no clue what was going on. Apparently I did something wacky at my retirement party. I don't... This offer won't last long. Hi, Flora. Tired of completing puzzles to earn fossils? Looking for new ways to get the rocks you need? Your search is over. Presenting Fossil Cores, Fossil Combiner, and Rock Tumbler. Download the extension to add this exclusive offer to your shop. Terms and conditions may apply. Okay. Thank you. Ooh. Fossil combiner and rock tumbler. I think I might need that at some point. Let me go back to this. Three fossils. I wonder if the uh, fossils can change. What else should I buy? Oh, this is a nice display case. I don't have enough for that. This one's only 20. This one's 30. I'm gonna get the big, 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 big. This one holds six. Let's put this here somewhere. Whoops, where'd it go? Oh, I guess it has to go here. No. Do I not have room for it? Does it go, oh, it goes on the wall? Oh, dang it. Can I even move? Where's it supposed to go? Oh, I see. I can put it. No, I can't put it there. I can put it. One and two. How do I stash hang this? Okay, I think I understand. This. 
Yes. No, I think I can hang this. Ah, okay. So that sign was in the way. I don't need that sign. Somebody just wanted a photo of it, so whatever. Let's put our number threes in there. Oh no, let's put our special ones in there. Look at our sparkly shells. They're so pretty. And then I'll put the four uh, number threes in there. My stash. This one. Oh, that's right. It has to go in the pocket first. And then my other number three. And that's it. Okay. And then we go here. And, whoops, I need to zoom out. Back. Let's put this here. One. Put this here. There we go. Oh, that's so pretty. Okay. But we still need one more. We need one more there. I'm going to put this ugly one over here. Sorry, sorry, you're not ugly. You're not ugly. You're beautiful. Shop to do list. Oh, there's another one. Good, I'm glad I reached it. I'm glad you reached out. I'm sure that that'll make him happy. It was good to talk, Laura. Let's get dinner next time. Okay. Great. Okay, and I still need I still need that. Maybe I should do trilobites? Wait a minute, let me go back to the mail. Do they have to be shells? Fossils. Oh! Oh! I'm dumb. Oh, no I'm not. I'm not. I'm not dumb. I'm not dumb. I just wasn't thinking. Fossils can be trilobites as well. I wasn't even thinking about that. I was just thinking the shells. <laughs> Fossil bites. <laughs> there could be a three in here. Alright, these are trilobites. Oh, ah, trilobites. They evolve the same way as shells. One trait change per generation. Okay, cool. This is purple? No, no, this is blue. These are purple. Do, do, do. This is red. This is red. This is brown. Brown. And brown. Oh, nope, red. <laughs> All righty. Okay, so on the trilobites, they have uh, lobes. Okay, we've got number of lobes. A trilobite can gain or lose a lobe. The head, trilobite's head can shape and change. And the size, a trilobite can grow bigger or smaller. One change per generation. Okay, so it could be this one because everything is the same. Actually, it has to be both of them because there's nothing else to connect it to. Then we have. It's a different shape. there and this one with this one because it looks exactly the same to me except this one's smaller this one's bigger then we have one change that's probably it because it's just they want to go easy on us at first nope that's wrong that's wrong oh, I'm a nerd. It's wrong. this looks exactly the same Oh no, the head shape's different. Okay, it's the same as this one too. What the heck? What the heck? Well, it can only 
only be one or the other. What? What? Okay, obviously these are wrong then. Because, yeah, there's only one way it could go. There we go. Why do these go together? I guess... Oh yeah, the head shape is different. Okay. And then... This is the same, but it lost a lobe. Okay. And these have to go with these. this one because it's the only one left. Process of elimination. All right. Do I have a three? No, I do not. Okay. I like this one. That's pretty. A blue trilobite with eye stalks. Okay. Remember the trilobite over here. And I'm gonna go get another stash. Hey, what happened? My crap is still here. Maybe I had to go to the shop. Hey, hello. Hi, Flora. I'm surprised to hear from you. To be honest, I've been working. Bo it's been boring without you. There's a grad student here, but now, but he talks too much. I was worried after your retirement party. You seemed like you were really troubled. I was. Okay. Alright, let me go to the shop because maybe I close this. Maybe that's where I get the um Yeah, here it is. Fifty. Oh. Whoops, I don't have fifty. Never mind. Never mind. Okay. Get a box. Another box of trilobites. Okay, this is... Oops. Some trilobites curled up when they died, poor guys. Sad for them, and sad for you. Their curling makes it hard to see their traits. <gasps> oh, no. This one. Try to find it and pick up the curled trilobite. Nice! You can rotate the curled trilobite to see it better. Click and drag the rotation icon. So, you can see, ah, uh, okay, so it's got one, two, three lobes. It has, like, devil horns or something, and the head is smooth. It does not have eye stalks. It's got, or is that the eyes? I'm not sure. Okay, cool. This, oh. Nice, but note, curling is not a genetic trait. Whether or not a trilobite curls is random, depending on how spooked the little guys were when they died. Aww. So like pill bugs. Oh, pill bugs are probably descendants of the trilobite. They have uh, lobes and they curl up when they get scared. Wow. You might see two things change between related trilobites. A genetic trait change plus curling or uncurling. Complicated. Okay, but that's not a trait. It's just, it might be curled, it might not be curled. Okay, this one is teal. This one is blue. This one is purple or blue. I don't know what that is. This is purple. That's blue. This is also blue. This is also blue. Wow. This is green. This is green. Okay, so we have a curled trilobite. We have a bitty trilobite. A teal trilobite. And I think the color does not matter. I've mentioned that before. The color has nothing to do with the traits. It's just to help you categorize them. It's just so you know where to put them on the family tree. Alrighty. So this will obviously, whoops, hello. Both of these have to go with this one. Oh, that's the end of that one. 
so we're not using that one anymore. This one, though. There we go. This one is going to go... Well, it has to go with both of these, right? Because there's nothing else to match these two. Sneaky! Sneaky! Alright, so now we gotta figure out which ones go with this. And at least we don't have to worry about this one anymore. I need water, sorry. What time is it? Oh, geez, it's after three. I was only gonna play till three, but I got started late, so I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep going till I finish this level. Actually, I'm gonna keep going unless my husband calls me for dinner. I'm gonna keep going until I get a number three fossil. Then I can get paid. Then we can pay those kids to take all our crap away. Okay, this is one, two, three, four. This is one, two, three. The sh head shape's different though. It goes with this one. Yeah, get out of here. Ding. Let's move this over. Sorry. Sorry, little trilobites. Okay. So you notice this has a, a stripy nose or a head. This doesn't. Excuse me. So these could go with either one still, but it's just something to notice. This only has two lobes. Uh, this has one, two, three. One, two, three. It could go with either one. What else is different? What else is different here? Oh, the head is the same as this one. So it could go. Yeah, because otherwise it'd be two things that changed there. Okay, and then we have a smaller one. It looks identical to this one. And then this one is, it just has one more than this one. Ha ha. Give me a three, give me a three. Show me a three. Really? <laughs> okay, I want the little curled fossil. Or do I? Yeah, I like the big ones. Um, I like this one. It looks like a car. The front of it looks like a car. Okay. Abshibidisio. A blue number one trilobite with back facing horns. Okay. I call them devil horns, but whatever. Back facing horns. Oh shoot. I already had one. Are these identical? No, they're different. Okay. Whew. Back. Alright, let's go. We're still trying to find a number three. So let's go back to the trilobites. Put it on our table and unpack it. I need a number three trilobite. This is... Yeah, I know. Okay, these are both blue. This is purple. This is teal. This is brown. And it's curled up. You can see tell by the little rotator thingy. Here's another purple one. Here's another teal. A brown. Another brown. And another brown. Okay, cool. Let's get to it now. We have, these two trilobites have two different shaped heads. We got the car shaped head here, and we have um, the non-car shaped head. Um, let's see. And again, this doesn't have, this is the same shape head, but he is, Okay, these 
lobes are, they have the same number of lobes, uh, they have the same nose, or the same, same head shape, but they're different sizes. So like here, the lobes get smaller. So let's see if that's a match. I don't know, and we're not going to know until... Oh, alright, it is a match. Okay, this one, same shape body, different shaped head. Hmm. Same size, just a different shaped head. Oh, well, these both have to go with this because that one's done. That's the end of the family tree. And I was wrong, you don't have to click directly at the top, you just have to be precise. You have to go click. Click. Alright, now this one, uh, it's got a, I don't know what you call that, the head shape. This is a wide head and a rounder head, I don't know. I'm gonna call it smooth and spiny. How about that? This has a spiny head, not spiny, ribbed. It's more ribbed. Or is this more? I don't know. I don't know what I call that. Okay, this. Alright, cool. That's done. This looks similar to this one, but the lobe shape is different. It's wider. Yes, okay. <clears throat> this one. It's the same, except the head is different. Alright, this one's curled up. What is it? One, two, three. And how do they... They're wide. It's okay, these are pretty wide. So it's got... This is the shape of the head, but the... Whoops, sorry. The body shape is different, so I'm gonna go with that. <sighs> yes! Okay. Do I have a three? I don't have a three. I'm sad. I'm gonna go with this teal colored car shaped one. A teal one trilobite with back facing horns. Nice. I'll just put them right here for now. I still need to get more. I'd still need a number three. Let's go back to the email. Hello. Thank you for explaining, but I don't think you need to apologize. I'm glad you started working again. Why did you stop? red, this one is blue, green, blue, this one's blue but he's curled up, this one is green, red, brown, brown, and brown. Okay, let's get to it. This one looks very similar to this one here, this blue one, but it's missing a lobe. So I'm going to connect it with this one. Then this one, the head shape is uh, the same here, but it is missing a lobe as well. And then this one has a different head shape. Yeah! <laughs> All right, now we can see if this one matches this in any way. It has one more lobe and the head shape's different, so no, that does not go with that one. The head shape's different. There are three lobes. No, it's not, okay. Moving on. <clears throat> this is very similar to this. Oh, 
And that's the end. That's the end of that one. This guy has one, two, three lobes and a smooth head or a wide head. I don't know. I mean, that looks smooth, but I want to say it's got a car. It's what do you call that? It's got a hood instead of a head. This one has a hood because it looks like a car hood. This one. Uh, okay. Whoops. I forgot. I forgot what I was doing. One, two, three lobes. This has three lobes, and it's the same head, but they're smaller. So let's go with that. Um, yeah, because see, it couldn't be that one because it had two changes. It had a different head, and it had a different number of lobes. So, mm -mm. so this also has three, but they're a different shape, I believe. Yeah body shape. And this one, that looks the same. Body shape. Yeah. Now we just gotta find out where this one goes. Three lobes, three lobes. Is the head different? Yeah, the head shape is different. Very nice, very nice. <gasps> we got a three! We got a three! Now we can go! We can go back! We can uh, put it up here. Yes! Gorgeous! I'll put that up there for now, too. And I need a picture of this. And you take a picture by pushing the space bar. Take a picture. Now I'm going to go back to my emails and send the picture to the person who asked for the picture, and then we'll get paid. Ha ha ha. Drag my photo and reply. <gasps> Finally. Okay, here's another one. Hello. And no, I don't think about that very much at all now. I worried more when I was much younger. Then I wanted to do something great. Now I think that I have been given a gift. I love fossil sponges. They're so interesting, even if they are completely irrelevant. <laughs> okay. Nice. Get fossils. Or trilobites. Oh, I just realized we can go pay those kids to take our crap away. So let's go. Let's go shopping. We have enough points. Are you sure you want to buy a new workspace for 50? Yes. Okay. You've unlocked a new workspace. To change workspaces, press the door button on the top left. Oh. Wow. So I cleaned up my garage and now I have a new workspace. You can move items between workspaces by putting them in your pocket. <gasps> Yay. Yay! What should I move over there? I don't know. I think we'll put the pretty ones over there. We're gonna put, whoops. Stash it. And we gotta go to the workspace and go to my stash. Oh, I have to re-put it up there? Oh, shoot. Did I do that wrong? Let me go back. What about the pocket? Oh, damn. I have to redo that whole space again. Let's see. I want the sparkly ones here. I want this sparkly one. And this sparkly one. Okay, we're gonna go back. Now we're gonna go to the other workspace. And we're going to put this here. And put these pretty. 
this will be just for the sparkly ones. Very nice. Okay, let's go back to the other workspace. I might change my mind. I don't know. Um, can I go out this door? I can look at the door. I can open the door. No, I cannot. Oh, there's a road. Okay, bye. Should I paint it green? No, it matches the rest of the... It matches the rest of the office. Okay, that works, space. I might end up moving stuff around. I'm not much of a interior designer. Well, it hasn't got too glitchy this time, so I'm thinking maybe I fixed what I needed to fix. Yay. There's a blue teal. Oh, this is also brown. This is red. This is green. This is green. And, um,. If you are colorblind, they have a setting on here for that. Let me um, show you the menu. Oh, you know what? It might not work. Let's see. Oh, it does. So you can see it shows you the number category. So one, two, three, four. And it shows you the name of it. So. If you are colorblind and you need that help, they have thought of everything in this game. So, uh, I'm going to go back to the settings because I don't want to look at a bunch of numbers on my screen. Sorry. Yeah, I just don't. If I was colorblind though, I would definitely use that. Okay, well this is the only one here, so it has to go to all of these. There's the end of that one. It has to go to this one. Here's the end of that one, and has to go to this one, and this one has to go to both of these, because they're the only ones there, and then we have, first of all, we can look at the shape of the head, it has the same shape, but the body's different. Does it have the same number of nodes? Yes, it does. Yay! All right, so that one's out of the way. This one has the same head as this one, but the body shape is different. Same size. Cool. This one is curled up, so we need to take a look at it. Whoa, one, two, three, four. Okay, it's got four, but the head is different, so we're gonna go with this one. <gasps> no. Was there something else that was different? One, two, three, four. I don't know. I guess it's just that it could go with either one, but they didn't want that one. So this one. Oh, look when you hover, you can see the spikes, the outline around the body. So if you can't really tell looking at it because it's kind of a shadow around it, you can hover over it and see like the body shape better like it shows how many spikes on the edge of the lobe there are like this one is stubbier this one is sharper it's got like spikes at the end maybe that's what i didn't see on that one okay so we have uh so i didn't realize maybe the body was different but it looked the same to me so same head different body yay Yay! Okay, I was gonna go quickly look over here. No comments. Yeah, I don't even know if anybody's watching this, but that's okay. That's okay. Where do I get my game? There it is. Okay. Oh! 
I said we were gonna play until I got those three. <laughs> I got them. So let's just pick um, a fossil. How about this curled up one? It's cute. Oh, how about the green one? It's green and curled up. It's so cute. They look like little aliens. But, um, I don't know where to put it. I'll just put it over here for now. Okay, so that's the end for today. I've been playing for over an hour. And uh, I also play on Twitch. You can follow me at Holly Seeks on Twitch. And uh, if I like my gameplay a lot and it seemed interesting, I usually make a video and post it on uh, YouTube. So I don't know. We'll see how this came out. If it came out good, I'll post it on YouTube because the other one was crap. It was just like, I told my husband, it's like a slideshow. It's just like, you could hear my voice fine, but the images were freezing like it was a slideshow. So, okay, when we come back, we'll read the mail next time. Okie dokie. That's all for now. Have a beautiful day. Happy gaming. How do I get out of here?